The new LEGO Marvel Summer 2024 sets have been revealed and I'm going to give my thoughts on them. The first set is Iron Man and Iron Legion vs Hydra Soldier. This works well as a small battle pack like set. The updated Iron Man Mark 43 looks fine even though I still don't love the newer helmet. I think the original Iron Legion figures from 2015 look a little better than these, mainly because of the helmets even though the smaller helmets are a bit more accurate, and I don't really care for the Hydra Trooper. But I do think the nice little fortress build with turrets looks pretty good for the size. The second set is Thor vs Surtur construction figure. It's nice to finally get Surtur as a build and he looks pretty awesome. It's a different type of construction figure because the design is a bit different with the head shape and it's actually supposed to be at a bigger size, unlike the other construction figures. For figures, we get an updated Thor with a new hard cape that I actually don't mind, and I like the lightning effect for his hammer, and the fire demon figures look cool. The third set is the Avengers vs the Leviathan. The Leviathan is a similar build to what we got in Avengers Tower, but definitely in a bigger size. I think it's nice to get this in its own set, and it looks pretty good. None of the figures though are new besides maybe slight differences, which is disappointing, but I don't know what new figure they could have put in this set. The fourth set is Dancing Groot. I think this is a cute little display set. The face on Groot looks a little strange and it's kind of a retread of the previous Groot sets, but at least this one is more unique with it being the pot variant. Still though, I have no interest in these types of sets. The fifth set is the Avengers Assemble Age of Ultron. I think it's awesome to get a full set based on this scene, and it's great to get all six original Avengers in it. The actual display build though does look kind of messy from the pictures, but I do like the builds for the vehicles with Cap's motorcycle and especially the truck. The sixth and final set is the Milano Spaceship. This is in a similar style to the Benatar set from 2021, and I think this looks as fantastic as that. This is definitely the best version of the Milano with it being super detailed and I think the previous versions weren't that great to begin with. The figures are nothing too interesting with this set, but they are nice updates to the originals barring Star-Lord's helmet, and it's nice to get a new baby group figure in the tan color. So those were my thoughts on the new Summer 2024 LEGO Marvel sets. These sets are all alright. Nothing stands out much to me personally, but it isn't a bad wave. But anyway, that's all I have to say. See you next time. Goodbye.